And when I checked, it was already over, so I could not get it. But hopefully, Creality maybe can send me like a unit of the K2 Plus combo and I will do a review for it. Hello, welcome to Scratch Daily Printing. In this video, I'll be taking a look at Creality K2 Plus. They have released the price and apparently there's like this event going on with Creality. When they do their live stream, there's like a percentage off of the printer. Let's scratch to this topic. On June 5th, Creality did a live stream and if you watch the stream and you are early, there's like a form or a checkout pre-order the K2 Plus on June 5th for 50% off. I did try to wake up into that stream and potentially secure myself a 50% off for the K2 Plus combo, but I couldn't wake up. My alarm clocks went off, I turned off, went back to sleep, and when I woke up again, it's already past the time that Creality live stream. And when I checked, it was already over, so I could not get it. But hopefully Creality maybe can send me like a unit of the K2 Plus combo and I would do a review for it because the K2 Plus combo costs 1500 $1,500 or $1,499 but yeah I missed that live stream and I think on June 6th they would do another live stream for 40% off and I forgot what day is after that maybe June 9th or they do it like 5, 6, 7, 8 50% off, 40% off, 30% off and 20% off so once I wake up and I missed it I got notifications on reddit and people were saying that they couldn't even pre-order it because once they do it they got some sort of error which i will show you right now okay now i'm in in reddit on creality k1 and this person called dylan posted this what a poop show k2 after finally getting to check out i met this error saying that they don't have available shipping options even though i had several products delivered from them now i'm blocked <laughs> it looks like for whatever reason i think he did join creative live stream and once he gets to this page like he said there's no available shipping option for him and then he gets this error it did say that he's been blocked so let's go down in the comments and see what people are saying this was really poorly done. Many people including myself had the printer in the final stage of checkout just to have it air out and eventually completely fail. If you had it in your cards and were in the process of checking out, Creality should honor the purchase and the discount in my opinion, I was very disappointed. So it's not only this Dylan person, this other person C small has the same error and then this dude says that cheap Chinese garbage website. Should we have expected anything else from Creality? It could be Creality or it could not be Creality. It could just be the page that was not well set up. But yeah, like people said, Creality should have actually made this a little bit more better so that people can actually check out and stuff like that. And then this person is saying, did you really expect to get one of those 200? Just wait until they fix all the issues and you can get one for 600. How would you get one for 600? And then he said, never buy a 3D printer directly from the manufacturer. I bought my K1 Max directly from ready and they ship it fast and it actually arrives pretty nicely except we got a scratch this other person also has the same error but it's with the 404 and then another person also got an error when trying to check out the text was wrong and he had to update it back to options to ship in the us and then this person said i just can't get over what they cost in australia 2500 australia dollar and what is creative smoking he got a P1P with AMS for less than that. That is true, but a P1P, the build volume is quite small compared to the K2 Plus. Not sure how much a P1P with the AMS cost in Australia. Another person said that same here, customer service was useless as usual with Creality. Not even talking about Creality, but I got blocked pretty often. Oh my gosh. And yeah, people just getting errors left and right. Same issue, almost got it for 750 euro, but then no delivery options to Denmark. I don't know what's going on. My thoughts could be that many people are trying to get this deal of the 50% off. And the people that get the error is like behind all the people that already purchased it and secured the spot there's only 200 units of this and maybe the 200 unit is already up so then there's no more shipping options or something like that but i don't even know okay so now i am in creality's store and we can see this that the printer goes for 14 99 basically $1,500 for this K2 Plus and like I said today they did a live stream of this 200 units of the K2 Plus combo 50% off for 749 50 cents many people could not get it or it was already sold out but it's fine tomorrow they would do another live stream with 40% off for 500 units so it could be around 850 ish I can't do the math right now but oh boy the price is 
1500 oh my gosh that is quite high but if you actually think about it the build volume the active heated chamber and then the a mass from creality 1500 is okay-ish but for those people that are on a budget it's actually quite high even for me it's actually quite high so if we go down here we can see all the dates so on June 5th, it's going to be 50% off for 200 units worldwide. And then on June 6th, 40% off worldwide, 500 pieces. And then they will delay. June 14th, 30% off for 800 pieces. And then July 1st it will be 1,000 pieces for 20% off. And if we look here, shipped from September 20th. So it's like four, five months away before they even release this K2 Plus. And then if you pre-order on June 6th, September 30th will be shipped out. And then you might receive it around October 10, October 20th. It depends on how fast the shipping is. And if you buy on June 14th, it will be shipped out from October 10th. And then July 1st, it will be shipped out on October 15th, which is quite a while. It's about four months away. As of right now, it's a long time. I feel like this is kind of like a Kickstarter, but it's not on Kickstarter. Creality just do a Kickstarter themselves in like a pre-order. But I feel like it's a Kickstarter because it's four months away before they actually shipped out. And maybe they are doing this to get the fun, maybe to get the fun in order to really produce all the K2 Plus and, and the AMS. So that they will have it ready and be shipped out on September. And if we go down here, if 700 piece sold, you will unlock this. 1,500 piece sold, we will unlock this. And then 2,500 piece sold, we will unlock this. Uh, not quite sure what this is actually. Maybe if people are buying it, they will unlock this, this, and this, and they will get it for free. I don't know. Impressive key feature, multicolor printing, yes. A Poos, what is this? A Poos Direct Drive Extruder, that looks pretty cool. Tilt Detection, FOC Closed Loop Motor, nice. Build Volume 350 by 350 by 350, that is actually really nice. And Active Heated Chamber. And look at these amazing prints that people have already printed. And this dragon looks sick. Featured on all of these are, I want mine to be here. Scratch 3D printing, <laughs> hopefully one day. Hopefully one day. And here is all of the places that is available. They have fully released all the spec of the K2 Plus. And look at this. Printing speed is still the same. Acceleration has actually increased a bit. They just have all of these. If you want to, you can go ahead and read all of those. Heated chamber is only up to 60C. Bed is 120C. Nozzle is 350C, which is pretty nice. The first one here, what are its key difference from K1 and K1 Max? This part actually caught my eye. And it supports intelligent CFS unit for multicolor printing, 3D printing, and automatic filament backup. So based on this, will the Creality K1 and K1 Max not be compatible with Creality's filament system? That is a question to be answered i don't know well yeah creality has released or give us information about their k2 plus but it's not going to be shipped out until september 10th i think it might just be a 2025 3d printer that is amazing creality has released all the information about their k2 plus combo and oh boy 1500 dollars is ooh, a lot creality i'm ready for sponsors anytime Feel free to check my email on my YouTube channel page about. <laughs> and yeah, I think the K2 Plus might be a 2025 3D printer unless they actually made all the units and shipped out on September and October, then it'll be 2024. But if not, and if there's delay, it could potentially go on to 2025. So that's like a long, long way until the K2 Plus is actually released and people are getting their hands on it. I really want to get my hand on the K2 Plus and the multi-filament system. It's going to be crazy. I would love to do so much testing and printing on that system and that 3D printer. It's going to be amazing. But that'll be it for this video of me checking out Creative's K2 Plus of the fully released specs and the price. And checking out their pre-sales going on right now. 
yeah, it's a lot to take in, but it's a really exciting year, and that'll be it for this video. And thank you so much for supporting this channel, and as always, keep on 3D printing.